a stream if I wasn't still trying to set up when I start. Yeah, I just need to get the chat up on my other monitor and then move my monitor into a place where I can see it better. I'm actually thinking about changing the monitor on this. I use it because it's the only 180p monitor that I have besides my TV. There's up. But it's so old that the... I'm not even sure if it's LED or... I don't think it's LED. I think it's old LCD. And, uh... It's kind of faded. I have an old, or not an old one, another monitor. I got two other monitors that neither of them are 1080p. They're a little bit lower resolution, not much, but they're old, older. They're like lighter. One of them's like really super thin, and uh, they have brighter, crisper colors than this good monitor. More. Hold on one second. I actually have to put that monitor, there we go, in front of one of my speakers to be able to see it from chat very good. And uh, that kind of muffles out some of my, my sound. But yeah, I think I'm gonna might be changing that monitor next day or two if I think about it while I'm while I'm not streaming. I only think about it when I'm streaming because that's the only time I use the monitor anymore. This is hooked up to my other <coughs> my second computer. Not my third one. Or my fourth one. They got other stuff on them. So yeah, a little update on my channel. I am, I just finally today recorded all of the first week of Fallout New Vegas. Seems like it turned out pretty good. It's a little slow in the beginning though. So if you watch it, it's a little bit slow in the beginning because I'm kind of explaining the setup. Oh, my son is watching Harry Potter with his door open pretty loud. Hold on one second. Johnny, shut your door! <laughs> Hope that didn't break somebody's ears. Where the hell did I end up last night? Not last night. Two or three nights ago. He's still got his freaking door open. Okay, I don't remember what I was doing. Let me check the quest list and the maps. I think I was just exploring the last time I played. Oh, map. There we go. Yeah, I was just exploring. So I think I've continued that. Let me go up here to the, where this... How did I... Go to that area. Without opening up the marker. I passed that area. The last time I played, I came from that area. I'm not sure what it is. It's not too far. the hell 
Oh. Oh, you scared me. I think it's down in there. Try a sniper rifle. I've got this one. Got it. Dang, that one works pretty good. I like my new sniper rifle. Mr. P, what's up? How you doing? First one here. Another stingwing. Where's it at? Where is it at? Here it is over there. It's trying to get over here, I think. My sniper rifle. It's coming fast. Oh, oh no, oh no. What's after? Oh, there's two of them. Hang it. Get a better gun. Oh, oh. Damn it. They got them both. Damn it. <laughs> yeah, I don't need none of their crap. How you doing today? I already asked you that, huh? <laughs> and I'm trying to get down in here to this radiated, irradiate a death claw, death claw. Oh, death claw! Yeah. He ain't nothing to this gun. Whoa. Let's say old gullet sinkhole doesn't look like I thought this was a like a nuclear bomb crater or something death claw where was he at was he hiding in here I didn't even see him till I got down here oh hey buff out Oh, I'm doing pretty good. I uh, was just saying a minute ago, I've been working on my new Fallout series today. I got the first week recorded. I started uh, Fallout 3 last week, and I started Fallout New Vegas today. Actually, I recorded it yesterday, and I got interrupted a bunch of times. My son getting home and a bunch of other things. And... Uh, so I had to quit in the middle of it and so I just started it completely over today recorded about four hours of stuff I've got to cut it down into seven episodes okay I'm gonna go in here oh well, there she goes there she goes let me save before I go well, so I'm looking forward to getting that up I'm going to edit it tomorrow, I think. Woohoo! Going down into the sinkhole. <laughs> they just drop in. Or at least one of them did. Oh, there's two. So heard somebody else drop in. Oh, crap. Bozo mask. Bozo did not look like that. Who's, who's shooting what? Oh, ow. 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 This dead guy. B bottle of brandy. Maybe it's over. Where I came from? Oh, they're still shooting at stuff. Oh crap, ghouls! Yeah, 
Yeah, some people had a freaking party down here. A bunch of bottles of brandies. Liquor. Because it's quicker. Yes. Permanently swim 25% faster. I guess that's it down here. Roach meat and bottle caps. Oh, hey, there's a ghoul in the wall. I think he's dead. Saw some dude. I would record weekly. I would record weeks of footage, but I am not too sure. <laughs> hey, Lost, what's up? Lost in the house. Lost in the house. All you really got to do, it's pretty easy. Now that you have that movie maker, you just record a couple hours worth of stuff at a time, and then you can split it up into like 20 or 30 minute episodes with the movie maker. You just bring it into the movie maker and... Uh, Go to the starting, where you want the starting point to be. And if you go to the edit tab, you can hit start, make starting point here. And it'll say, say if you're starting at the start, you, at the very start, you don't have to worry about it. Just go like 30 minutes in and and watch, a, watch it back and forth a few times in that area. Or say 20 minutes in or whatever. Watch it back and forth a little bit in that area to find out a good cutting spot so you don't cut right in the middle of saying something, you know? Or right in the middle of uh, action sequence, you know, right when you're freaking shooting a bunch of shit. You don't want to stop right in the middle. You wait until that part's over, or, or right before it happened. And then click right there, and you can move it back and forth a few frames with that where, where the play button is. <coughs> <coughs> then you hit in scene here or in make in point here or something in point here and click on that and it'll end it there and then then you bring back in your thing and and put your next starting point exactly at that same ending point for the for the episode before it and then go another 30 minutes in or 20 minutes in and make another starting point or ending point and then bring the bring it back in i i actually cut i have fraps stop my videos and start a new video every 3.9 gigabytes that way if it only records about it, it it'll only record about six minutes or seven minutes worth of stuff at a time and that way, if my computer crashes or something, I don't lose hours or an hour worth of footage. I only lose six or seven minutes at the most. Because if the computer crashes, most times it'll corrupt the data file or the movie file. So you don't want to freaking lose everything. So that's the one good thing about Fraps that I've seen. Why are you getting my way when I was looking at the shelf? Dang. That's the one only good thing about fraps that I can say is that you can cut your movie up into smaller segments without even doing anything. Just click on a button, tell it how big you want the files, and uh, then it'll stop automatically stop them there. And so what I'll, I'll do is I'll just bring in the first um, five files, which is about 30 minutes. going on over here? We walked into a firestorm. 
Let them play it out. Boom. He's going to blow up any minute now. Oh, he's actually landing. Those things usually blow up. Every time I've ever seen them, they end up blowing up. But yeah, I'll put, put in about five episodes. Find the ending point, or find the starting point where I want to start. Find the ending point. And then um, the last part of the segment of the video. Once I find the ending point of that, then I'll bring that last segment back in again. And then put five of them in front of that. You know, I don't know. It's hard to explain. I got a little system the way I work it. So what is this guy doing over here? And why did that vertebrate not crash like they usually do? Oh. He burned up some people. Something here. What the hell is going on? It's a tank bot. Wow. What the hell is that thing? <clears throat> Wasn't he just standing here? There was... This... I swear to God, a second ago, there was... One of these guys just standing here. It wasn't him? He's got T-60 armor on. I don't have any T-60. Float fly got him. Okay, maybe there's another dude in power armor wandering around here, but I could have sworn there was one just standing right there. He was standing up. And something got out of that vertebrate. That is just weird. Yeah, play, playing uh, Fallout New Vegas again. There's a lot of differences in Fallout New Vegas and Fallout 4 that I wish they would have kept in. Um, on the compass thing, right in the middle, uh, bottom screen. In Fallout New Vegas, if there's anybody around, any creatures, any NCPs, NPCs, there, it makes a little mark on your compass. So you know where everybody is. If they're anywhere around you. And if they're enemies, if they're hostile, it turns them red. They're regular color, like white in this case, or light blue, whatever it is. Um, if they're friendly, and they're red if they're hostile. I wonder if there's a mod or if... St not I should make one I'll, I should try to make a mod that does that but it really really freaking helps out man when you're looking around for people like right now it'd be really easy to find if there was another one of them Brotherhood of Steel guys around oh well where am I going now What's this up here? Oh, it's a farm. It's a settlement that I haven't opened up yet. Uh, what? Lost? What do you mean? Let me see. I missed that. Let me scroll back up a little bit. Funnin' with Mrs. Right, I'll give it a go tonight. Maybe some dying light. Yeah, 
it's better if you can record it all at once instead of only recording 20 minute episodes at a time or 30 minute episodes and then having to stop and then waiting a couple you know until the next day to record some more or whenever or you know it's better if you can record them all at once um chicka chicka bow wow <laughs> Oh, mess messing around with the wife. Is that what you're trying to say? Or the, the better half? Um, he has a legendary weapon. Green Top Nursery. Yeah, I haven't opened this up yet. I haven't been doing Preston's things. Hey, dude. Hey, what Lucas. up? Got the best armor in these parts. I could also do a Fallout 3 series if I wanted. I don't have any DLCs. Sure. Let's take a look. Got plenty of stock. Take your pick. Well, you got to get the DLCs. You could probably get some kind of a deal on the DLCs. Actually, I think you can get the whole game with DLCs on g2a.com for probably around 5 bucks. <laughs> pretty sure that's where I got mine and I did not pay that much for it okay so what am I doing oh he just mostly has apparel it looks like and Manus left arm nothing good it's this one wastelander right leg and nah. nah. Later, dude. Okay, there's one more area around here. This over here. What's this? What's that away? Sam, please. What's up? Oop. Oh. And Darslin, hey! I'm also thinking of doing a PG-13 series of Lego Batman. <laughs> yeah. don't know if there's a game about it but I was looking for graphics and stuff to make my thumbnails for Fallout for the new series is ow 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 oh, 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 oh. damn it <laughs> I was just shooting at that where'd it go and what else is shooting at me That was some swift move there, boy. But yeah, I, I noticed that there was a there was a picture of a Lego Lego dude on Google of um, a dude in power armor for Fallout, a Lego Fallout character dude. That was pretty cool. I got to get me one of those. Terminal. I don't know where we're at. I'm going to go check it out. Do I own Photoshop? No, I use a, a free graphics program called paint.com. And it does all the same things as Photoshop. Probably not as elaborate as Photoshop, but you can go on to 
some websites and download plugins for it and get some pretty good, good stuff. Pretty good plugins if you search it long enough. So you could do a lot of crap with it. I like it. There's also another one called GIMP. I haven't messed with it yet. A lot of people seem to use it. And it does a lot of the same things as Photoshop also. Best night ever, Dars, if you know what I mean. Nope, don't know what you mean. Don't know what you mean. If you're doing it with the missus and, and, and you do that every night anyway, every night's the best night. Unless she's doing something special tonight. Which we do not want to know. I'm just saying. Not asking. I'm just saying. <laughs> T-Y-I. T-M-I. T-Y-I. T-Y-I. To your information. There is, oh, here's one. Not a whole lot. That was the only dud in the whole freaking mess, but I think that's all I needed was one, right? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, there we go. Oh, got the first one anyway. Power that elevator. Whoa. Whoa. There's some weird graphic going on here. I don't know if I want to go into there. I'm saving. Oh, that's not the right button. So I finally got my son to um, going down. let me use this freaking credit card to get me a new controller receiver somebody's in the wall but it takes three to ten days to get here that's probably business days so it could be up to two weeks before it gets here but I thought about it afterwards and I also should have ordered a wired 360 controller They're probably pretty cheap now the um, Xbox One controllers are about 40 or 50 bucks. So I'm figuring the Xbox 360s should be in the 20s. Oh, 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 oh. What in the hell's a Yagway doing down in here? Oh, well, I don't think I've ever been here before. Yagwa. Yeah, um. Ooh, ooh, there's stuff in there. You gotta go through the Yagua den to get it, though, I bet. And, uh. Okay, let me check out this terminal. All right. But yeah, I should have I should have ordered another one. Uh, main reason I don't want a Xbox One controller. LP Bravo monitoring report. Um, is that some of the older games actually are set up for Xbox One? I mean Xbox 360. It says if you look in Fallout New Vegas in, in the um, settings. It asks you if you're using. It just says 360. So it's asking you if you're using. It says controller 360. So it's asking you if you're using a 360 controller, not an Xbox One. Hey, what's this? Best night ever. 
LOL. I use Fotar, Fotor on my Mac, or I use Photoshop, but I don't have it on my PC. The school gave it to us on our MacBook. The school gave you Photoshop? Dang, Photoshop's actually pretty expensive. I haven't tried to price it in years, and I did have legit copies of Photoshop back in the 90s when it was actually halfway cheap. But nowadays it's like $500 or so, ain't it? It's like expensive. So if you're getting it from school cheap, man, feel, feel lucky. Right now I'm using my son's PS4 controller, which kind of sucks. Sometimes I use this Xbox One controller because they have wires and I can actually plug them in to my computer because my wireless receiver went out. I've got quite a few Xbox 360 controllers, wireless ones, but none with wires, none with cords. Glad to, how tall is she? She who? Glad to hear you had a good night lost. Hope you are feeling better. Feeling better. Hey. The Xbox One controller is the exact same controller, just bigger and smoother. I think it works a little different because... If you hook it up to a computer, I already have the 360 drivers on my computer, but when I plug in the Xbox One controller, it actually gives me an error, then it crashes a program that's set up for 360. Crashes the drivers, the driver program. Um, so it's using different drivers for, for, for one thing, so it's... It doesn't seem as smooth either. I can handle a 360 controller a little bit better. It's smoother. It's easier to use. It, I don't know. It's hard to explain. The feel of it's a lot better. And I like. I, I don't like the bulkiness of the Xbox One controller. It's a little bit more bulky. And the triggers feel different. And this one feels really weird. This. PlayStation 4 controller. Take, yeah, thanks to the IT class. Uh, what now? Xbox or this bigger one? We got the full Adobe Suite. Damn. That's good, man. There's some good stuff in there. Oh, what was I trying to do? I was trying to read this, huh? Okay, Captain Rutledge. Rutledge. Captain Rutledge ordered me to take over long range monitoring today. That means four weeks stuck in this bunker with only military rations, old magazines, and a transistor radio to keep me company. However, I'll take or I'll try and make the best of it by doing my job and monitoring the airwaves for any suspicious transmissions. Maybe next month I'll get a more interesting assignment, but for now it's time to kiss the light of day goodbye for a month oh uh, yeah okay forget it this guy's just it's some monitoring station for the enemy turret control there was one outside and offline cleared okay huh all right and yagua yagua I like saying that. Yagua. What is that? Yagua meat? Yagua. What's going on over here? 
Let me out of here. I'll just go into this. That's it. Uh, That's it. Look like there was going to be more to this. <sighs> Bet you if I read all of those things, there's more to this, but I don't want to do that during the stream. I read funky. Going up. Anyway, I'll catch you in the next class. I'll be about five or ten minutes <laughs> there's somebody else that always used to watch from class I can't remember who it was whoa dang I'm just not walking too good today um, this looks like the only place on the map this area of the map that I haven't been to yet. Let's check it out. It is that away. It's another settlement. There's another settlement over that way too that I haven't been to. I don't remember what settlement's up here. Oh, this isn't a settlement. This is a... Super Mutant Camp. Yep. Let's do this. Oh, I forgot there's one up here. Oh, hey! Hey, buddy! Oh, God! Oh, God, two of them! Oh! I'll, I'll squish you like a rad roach. Is that what he said? No, I'll shoot you first. Oh, he's got rad roach meat on him. He knows. He knows about his rad roaches. He knows him his rad roaches. There's a glitch in this part right here. Oh crap, what'd I just shoot? Ah, did one of them just run in front of me? There's one more over here. There he is. Oh, this gun. <laughs> Die. There's some kind of um, mission that you have to do here later, and it never clears. There's something you're supposed to find here that I never can find. Bug on a shell. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay, there's a bunch of super mutants dead up here. Go. Get their crap. What was that? Blood. Oh, 
Where's the other dog? Here he is. There was another super mutant up here, I thought. There he is. I'm so gutted. I missed your live stream. Uh, don't worry about it. Lost, I will be streaming next Sunday too. There you go. We'll definitely watch. I am just glad you are feeling better. Hope your doc appointment went okay. Oh, you had one today? Went really good. Yep. That's cool. Okay, what? Let me go up here. I get myself dizzy in this game. That's it. Oh wait, what's in here? Medex. Okay. What about the toilet? Nothing. All right. I think that's it. There is nothing else this way, or that way, or that way. There's a settlement I haven't been to this way. I don't know what it is, but let's go check it out. But there's another turret that's over here somewhere, I think. Did I... What you doing, bro? What's up? <laughs> Son went to Universal Studios and got some Harry Potter looking stuff. A robe and stuff that he's going to use for Halloween. It's going to be that Slytherin kid. Hey, Draco Malfoy, son. Malfoy? Yeah. Here's not long enough. He buzzed that shit back. What? Oh, 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 where's that at? Where's he at? Oh, there he is. That Malfoy had long hair. Maybe it's his dad. The hell? Oh, God, she's invisible. Oh, she's invisible. She's invisible. Where'd she go? Where'd she go? Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh, she's crawling. I must, must have shot her legs off. Is she still here? Where'd she go? There she is. Oh, those things freak me out when they turn invisible. Oh, there's two more. Oh, oh those are freaking bloat flies. Three more. There's three bloat flies. Oh, oh, splat. Oh, that was gross stuff. Gross stuff. Ooh, right in the butt. <laughs> bloat, black bloat fly, fly butt. Where's the other one? There's one more, I thought. Oh, the girls must have got the last one. Okay. Oh, no, it's down there. Something down there. Oh, that's the dead one. Red Widow Bug. Ooh. I don't know about Red Widows. That's one thing that they don't have in and I'm thankful for that they don't have in Fallout but they do in Skyrim is spiders mutated spiders I'm glad they left them out man those things would freak me out it's up here did 
If you imagine some big mutated black widows coming at you. Tarantulas wouldn't be as bad as mutated black widows coming at you with their little tiny legs and the big ass butt thingy. Here's the other bloat fly. I decided it was going to hide it, tail it out of here. Did I even hit it? No. Now I did. Where's that black widow bug? There it is. It's a red widow mosquito bug. Let's see if I can hit it from here. Long shot. Oh, I got it twice. One more. Oh, splat. Oh, skeeter in the pond. Midnight, what's up? Is this Witcher? No, it's Fallout. Fallout 4. I do this two nights and I do Witcher two nights. Back and forth. Hey! The Schlong. At least they didn't call it the Schlong. Let's see. That's, I think that's Yiddish for, for Wiener. The Schlong. Okay, I got something there for this guy. Um, Is your name Arlen? Oh, excuse me. Sorry. Sorry, didn't mean to ignore you. Just got caught up in my work again. So, what do you think? Nice, isn't she? What? What is it? Arlen Glass? The Arlen Glass? Are, are you the Arlen Glass? The toy designer? I am. Where did you hear that? Your daughter? Yep. Did you have a daughter? Marlene. She died in the war. I wasn't the best father. Too old. Worked too much. In the end, I... I never even got to say goodbye. I'll give him the tape, yeah. I think I have something that belongs to you. A uh, holotape? tape? Let's see now. He's gonna start crying. I don't want to be here. When he starts crying, his little freaking messed up eyes out. Hi, Daddy. When are you coming home? Marlene! Oh, God. Now you work too much. I want you to read to me again. Mommy says you're helping all the horses find good homes. Take care of them, okay? I have. I love you. And you. Hmm. Oh, <laughs> Buttercup says she loves you too. Me miss you. Come home soon. Oh, Marlene. I, uh, I, give me a minute. It's been so long. I never thought I'd hear their voices again. You can't imagine what this means to me. What happened? I lost my family. Yeah. It's a long story, but I lost my wife and son, too. And maybe... You can understand. She was right, you know. I did work too much. And now, I'll never hear her voice again. Never get to hold her. Kiss her goodnight. All I have left are the memories. And this tape. And this tape as one father to another. Thank you. What happened? What happened to them? We had an apartment in Cambridge. 
I went to the office that morning to try to talk to Mark again. When, when it all happened, I tried to get back, but the city was in chaos. By the time I got home, there was only a crater. I lay down in the ruins. I, I just wanted to die. Instead, I woke up like this. Is there a crater in Cambridge? I don't remember seeing a crater in Cambridge. Uh, what now? What now? I, I can't possibly repay you for this. Here, take, take everything I have. It's not much, but, and one more thing. I was saving this for her birthday. All these years, it was all I had to remember her by. Please, I want you to have it. I got too many buttercups, but thanks. <laughs> like maybe if it was a special one that I could actually ride around on, that'd be cool. Travel the Hi, Daddy. travel the wasteland on a when are you home? mechanical horse. That would be really cool. Let's we'll see now what now. Um, fix your title. Title. Oh, my stream. Oh, okay. Oops, yep, title. Still says Witcher. Oh, <laughs> Shoot him. Where's Beyonce at? What? Oh, what am I doing? I'm saving. Yeah, I don't remember Cam Crater in Cambridge. Okay, I'm gonna I'll fix my title. I always forget to do that. I actually thought about doing it earlier today, and then I just it just slipped my mind. So yeah, that's not good. Let me get my keyboard for my other computer and the mouse. Uh oh. Oh. Enjoy the Amazonness of Val while I'm doing this. God, I wish my son would keep his door closed while he's watching loud mu movies. Mouse doesn't work too good on my knee. Damn it. There we go. Ah, now it's slipping. This is not easy. Fall out. Four, four, four. I can't see. Fall out four. Modded. Mooded. Modded. With. DLCs. I think that's what I call it. Fall out for analysts. Oh crap, what happened? That was real good. Just click the wrong button completely. All right, looks like it's changed. Now, where's my remote or controller? I mean, there we go. Damn it! 
I didn't set the chat back. I cannot see if anybody's talking. I'm almost there. I'm a coming. I'm a coming. All right, there we go. End his suffering. Oh, guys. Oh, hey, Aaron. Aaron's here. What's up? She's too tall for the screen. There she comes. Hey, dude. What up? Woohoo. I look straight at her, directly at her. It's I'm like exactly leveled. Actually, under her titties, under her boobies. I gotta look up to look into her boobies. And I am not a small person here. Is that. Well, that's the junkyard over there. I'm gonna go freaking. I'm gonna go over here. Wait, oh, wait, oh, there's something else over here. You know what? I wonder what would happen. How do I do that? Oh, that's the, um, what do you call it? Ironworks down there. And I can't remember going here, but it looks like I've been here already once. I'm going to try something. There's a bobblehead over there, and I, I bet you I already got it, though. I'm going to try something. God, I wish it was freaking less foggy. I had to take my fog out mod out because it was conflicting with something. This playthrough. That sucks because I can't stand the fog. It's 11 a.m. Let's try a couple hours. Maybe the fog will lift. Oh, no no luck. No luck. Um, how do you wait again? Oh, there we go. Y. Yeah. Which is not actually a Y on this. It's a triangle on this. I don't know why they insist on calling it a Y. And it's... Now, I'm going to have to wait till tomorrow. Let's go for... Uh, so that's... 8 in the morning. <laughs> Make you laugh. All right, nice and clear day. Now we can see whose faces were were the killing. only way you get old in this job is assume everyone's out to kill you. Doc Weathers. Hey, at least it's honest work. Okay. Let's cross. Okay, that's where we're going. Over there. Let's cross here. Okay. This Homing beacon. That's what I want to tr try. This is supposed to be a nuclear warhead. Oh, wait, no, they, he doesn't have nuclear warheads. He has non uh, non thermal nuclear. Oh, oh, that's the quarry. I don't know. Is that close to that quarry? I think he has non nuke missiles left in the sub. See if I can sneak up far enough over, over here to throw. Wait. Okay, it shows on here that I haven't been here. Um, if you look at the compass, it's just an outline of three cars, which means that I haven't been here yet. But if you look on the map... Oh, 
Oh, that's here. Okay, that's the quarry over there, which has a bobblehead. Okay, I see somebody. I wish there was a way to throw these things far. I want to get close enough. Oh, crap. No, 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 no. Did I just wake them up? There we go. Let's see what happens. It's just po that one right there is pointing up in the air. Why? Standing down. Oh, 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 that's a, a Soltron. Oh, oh, before she turns invisible. Got her. I don't know why the missile attack didn't happen. I threw a homing beacon. Isn't that what I was supposed to throw? Throw another one. Wow, I can throw those things far. Oh, oh, something's going on. What the hell was that? That was it? Doesn't have a description. I wish I knew if those were even the right thing. They're supposed to, supposed to be something to link me up with the uh, submarine, so that he can sh throw a missile, or throw a missile, shoot a missile. You crazy? <laughs> Damn, Val! Val, she just jumped, jumped right in front of me, didn't she? Wow, what's going on here? Somebody's shooting me from this way. Who's shooting? This dude. Oh, down but not out. God, that hardly hurts him. At least this one doesn't have as bad a recoil as the other one. There he goes. Wow, his gun flew way over there. Did you see that? Ow. Right in the butt. You're down. Oh, that was a bad shot. down somebody else right over there there oh that's <laughs> that's my girl my girl my girl oh shit she's got a missile launcher or something how many bullets have left? hope it's not a nuke come on show your face come on I think that's the only live person left up there. Where's she at? Oh, there, wait, no, there's a couple people alive. Alive, I should say. Oh, she's got a freaking missile launcher. She's down. Oh, shot her in the leg. Oh. This, this um, thing might not have as good a zoom as the rest of them, but it's not too bad. Hiding? What are this you? rifle. Scared? Oh, ho, ho, shot her head clean off. Yeah. 
Oh, oh, what's going on? Somebody else is shooting. There's one person left over there somewhere. Let's go check it out. Let me uh, change guns. And there's supposed, supposedly dead bodies around here. I need to look for them so I can loot them. So I'm a looting machine. Loot machine. Because I'm a looting machine. Oh, well, there's no dead bodies right here. What happened to the... Oh, there it is. Sultron, I knew it was here somewhere. She don't have much to loot. This crap I don't want. Oh, hey! What are you doing? Everybody's up there that I shot, I think. Why am I hiding? Let him come. Let him come. I'm ready. Oh, crap. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. Oh. They're shooting me with a plasma rifle or something. Oh, almost fell. Come on, get out there. I, I guess I might be out of range of that. the um, submarine. That's why that didn't work. And I only have one more of those beacons left. So I kind of need to... Ooh, that's a nice shiny helmet. Spotlight. Let me turn that thing off. It's making too much noise. Ah. Okay, there's a drawbridge up here that you have to... Turn control. Crane. There we go. Crane control. Lower crane. Make sure so you can get up on the freeway. There's nothing in here. God, that thing's irritating. I thought I'd just turn that off. That sound? It's... The sp spotlights. They alert people when intruders are around. I don't even know where it's at. There it is. It's turned off, but it's still making noise. Shut up. I think there's two of them. Now, here's the other one. I hear another. I hear another one. There's another one coming. Okay, there's a trap right here. Red stag meat, mole rat meat, mm -mm -mm. cherry colas. Nice. Look 
looks like a nuclear bomb. A nuke clear. So yeah, the um, mods that I threw in Fallout New Vegas are pretty cool, man. Ooh, gunner brains. The place looks really good. I was I was trying to throw this other one in to that, that redesigns all the faces of all the people, but it was way too complicated to install. You needed all kinds of other crap, and then I was reading. Oh, there's the freaking other stupid light. I was reading all the technical crap about it. Well, there's way too chance, too many chances of it causing some freaking problems and a lot of crashes and all kinds of crap. I guess they didn't have the modding down as good when they did these last two, or these other two games, these, this one and uh, Fallout 3. Fallout 3 has the same mod though, but I think it might work better. I'm gonna, I'm, I haven't read up on them yet. Fallout 3 has all the same mods that I have in this one, which I'm gonna try to install. Um, I'm stuck. I'll try to install in there too. Most of them, at least. And uh, yeah, like I said, I think they work a little better because most of the ones for this were actually made for Fallout 3 and then they had to adapt them to this one and a lot of times they didn't do as good of a job adapting them as they should have. Okay, I think I'm actually going to do a mission. Wait. You know what, I'm going to go up to this place first because I went there once And I don't know if I got the uh, bobblehead because where is the bobblehead in this? Oh, I might have got it because there's two different times that you go here. One time you go and you have to drain it. You help this guy drain it. And then you come back later, and it's full of raiders. The guy's gone, and it's full of raiders. Wow, it brought me to the other side. Break on through to the other side. Yeah, this is full of raiders this time, so... But I can't remember where you get the freaking bobblehead from. If it was from before... Or after the raiders get here. So if it's from the first time when the guy was here. Oh wait, this is the wrong one. This isn't the same quarry. I've been here. I got the friggin' bobblehead there. There's another quarry closer to home here that I don't even see on the map. I think it's this one. I haven't been to it yet. That's where I meant to go. What a shot. A shoot. Ow. Ow. Oh, oh, ow. Ow, ow. Damn it. He's spitting. Sucker. Look at it. It messed up my nice, clean suit. What was it? Red stag. Let's try to get him in one head and then the other. Let's see what happens. Oh, okay. That's all it took. It's just one. <laughs> oh, there's another freaking damn bloat fly. 
Oh, no, that's part of the head. I thought it was a bloatfly flying. Where the hell am I? Where's the quarry? I could have sworn I just went to a quarry. Oh, no, it's south of me. It's south of me. There it is. It's under me. Where's the dude? This is the first time I've been here. The dude's here. No raiders. How do I get down there? I don't think I've ever actually looked inside this area. Is there anything good over here? It doesn't look like it. Looks like it's just a bunch of quarried marble blocks or whatever. Whatever they quarry up by Maine or um, Massachusetts. If we have a quarry around where I live, it's always gravel. Not gravel. Yeah. Or granite, I mean. Granite. There's a lot of granite in California. At least Central California. I don't yes. know about the coast. If anybody can hear music in the background, let me know because that's my son listening to. Got it. Freaking Harry Potter really, really loud. And I don't want to get a damn copyright violation from him watching a damn movie. Oh, hey. Oh, I thought that was a picture. Ah. Okay, this talks about the place. I don't give a crap. There's a dude right here, though. Hey, what up, buddy? Sully. Sully. <clears throat> Looking to earn some caps? Yep. I could use a hand here if you're all done gawking, you know. Done gawking? I'm not gawking. You gawking? I'm not gawking. I could probably help for a few caps extra. I was going to give you something anyway. 75 caps for your time? Uh. That was what? Help you with what exactly? I'm trying to fix this old water pump. Should be plenty of scrap in here. If I can get it drained out. Okay. What do you need help with? Now, the pump isn't in top shape, but it should at least start. There must be some leaky connections flooding me out. Think you could fix them? The leaks will be underwater. Look for bubbles, and you should find them. All right, that's it. Let me look on my my data thingy. There we go. Tune radio to Vault 88 radio beacon. What the hell's Vault 88? Wait a minute. Something's going on. I didn't, is there a Vault 88 in this? Valtech calling. There's no markers anywhere on the map. Vault 88 radio beacon. This is an emergency broadcast signal from Vault 88. Authentication code word, impish. Vault 88 emergency classification. Unspecified integrity breach warning. Any available Vault Tech personnel are required to respond under emergency protocol VT-76. 
This signal will repeat. Oh, what the hell? This is something weird going on here. This is an emergency broadcast signal. The hell is it? What is this? I remember at one point in the game, my, my first playthrough, I had something. I think it was this. Okay, I was thinking Vault 81. Once I went to Vault 81 and uh, checked it out, I was thinking, oh, maybe that's what they were talking about. But I think it was this. But it only lasted temporarily. Okay, I'm going to save right here. Authentication code word. Wait a minute. Impish. Yeah, I'm going to save right here. I'm going to do this dude's thing real quick. And hopefully that'll still be there. I, I need to get my son to shut his door or I'm going to shut my door because this is freaking ridiculous. Hold on a minute. I'm going to get a freaking vi copyright violation from freaking Harry Potter music. Close mine instead. He said it gets hot in here when the doors close. You don't have two freaking computers going. It gets really hot in here. Okay. So, so I did save, didn't I? Yeah. So I'm gonna go do this guy's deal real quick, and then I'll go do that. Has anybody else seen Vault 88? The new, D new DLC, it's out already? What? I didn't even see it load. This is an emergency broadcast signal from Vault the new, day, it, the new DLC is a Vault DLC, right? Emergency classification. Oh. This just shows mods. <laughs> A lot of mods. I thought the, no, the DLCs aren't listed here at all. I really don't have a whole lot of actual plug-in mods. I have other mods that don't plug in. They're just... I'm pretty sure that most texture type mods aren't plugins. Um, okay, I just saved, so I'm going to go to quit for a minute. I want to see, not desktop, just regular. Add ons. Shows Nuka World there. Wait. Vault Tech Workshop? Is that it? It's in here. Yep. That's what it is. Cool. All right. You, you mama, you mama, what's up, you mama? Yeah, I don't know what it is with... Then that must have been a Vault 81 that I was thinking about before. Because my first playthrough, I 
got some kind of a quest marker that said investigate vault 81 i'm i'm thinking it was now and i never did go check out vault 81 until way late in the game and uh it disappeared after a while Okay, so I'm going to actually do that after I'm done with this then. Turn that off now and put that one back on. And let's go jump in. Woohoo! Right, where am I going? Hang on. I jumped in right on the bubbles. Where's the bubbles? There they are. Got to fall this pipe down. There it is. There's some bubbles over here somewhere. Where they at? Bubbles. Bubbles. There you go. And what's the third bubble? Bubbles. Oh, what's under here? Can you actually swim down through all this stuff? Wow. I never even thought of freaking going and checking this place out. Uh, you guys are going to drown. I'm not going to drown because I could breathe underwater. I don't, it doesn't look like you can loot anything until this thing's drained. There's nothing to loot. Authentication code word English. Vault 88 emergency classification. Unspecified integrity breach warning. Any available Vault Tech personnel are required to respond under emergency protocol BT76. This signal will repeat. God, it's hard to see under here. There's not there's there's usually a, some pins in here for um Myrlurks. There's not even no Myrlurk pins cages. Yeah, there's nothing under here right now. Man. How freaking de deep am I? Oh. Uh, I didn't know if I could hold my breath that long. Thought I was a goner for sure. Right. Hey, Val. What up? We we'll talk to Sully before he sullies himself. Damn it! What's going on here? There we go. This is an emergency broadcast signal from I want to see what's up here real quick while I'm over here. Code word, Vault emergency classification. I don't think there's anything up here yet, is there? Oh, there's not even the radar thing. There's usually um under emergency protocol BT seventy six. This signal will repeat a couple little shacks in here. I guess they don't even have the shacks yet. Oh, hey, there we go. Bingo. Tattoo. Or another face tattoo. Why don't they get body tattoos? I mean you have to put a damn mod in if you want body tattoos in the game. Unspecified integrity breach warning. Oh hey. Any available vault tech personnel are required the, um, to respond under emergency A lot of other games you can get tattoos. This signal will repeat. Maybe if I close off this intake, I can get enough pressure. Uh <clears throat> that's a ticket. You do the honors. Hit that switch on the end of the pump. The switch? Listen to her go. This is an emergency broadcast. Wait, did you hear that? Vault 88. 
Authentication code word. Oh, Marler. What the? Let's do this. It's a mutated bastard. Oh, crap, another one. A Ghoul Slayer Institute rifle. Oh. Huh. Is there more of them bastards? No. Oh, he's a colorful one, ain't he? Look at that. This is an emergency broadcast signal from Vault 88. Hey, hey there. Meyer looks. I guess I didn't be surprised that started. Vault 88. Anyway, I still got some tinkering to do on this thing. Shouldn't be too hard now, though. Thanks for pitching in. There's a little something before you clear out. All right. All right, we got are going to the boat. Let's check it out, man. Oh. All right. New stuff. New stuff. This is an emergency broadcast. I like new stuff. I've been out this way, so it shouldn't be. Hyde Park. That's a good place to go. Available Vault Tech personnel are required to respond under Emergency Protocol VT76. So apparently, in this new mod, you're supposed to be able to build a vault, but maybe you have to do this quest first and go help out the area first, and then maybe this is the only area in the map that you can actually build your own vault. But appar apparently, you're supposed to be able to. Like using explosives to make an underground cavern to actually build your vault into, and I guess then you can get parts kind of like you could do with a with a settlement. This signal will repeat. Oh crap! I thought I've been here before. Why is this church not even on my map anymore? I know I've been in that church. Oh, what did he just hit me with? Damn. Dude's got some powerful freaking magic there. Wow. What is he? It's a robo brain. Dude got some powerful magic now. Watch out for his ugly ass. Where's the other one? There's two of them that I killed outside. What's in there? This morning, there's more than one out here. I lose shit all the time. It would be so easy for them to mark on the map where dead things are. On a mini-map or something. We don't even have a mini-map in this game. We should have a mini-map. Where the hell? I swear to... Okay, I started out over here, right? I ran this way. And I got shot. There's one. Okay. There's still one more up top somewhere. This is an emergency broadcast signal from Vault 88. Authentication code word, Impish. Vault 88 emergency classification. Unspecified integrity breach warning. Any available Vault Tech personnel are required to respond under Emergency Protocol VT76. Where's he at? This signal will repeat. Disappeared. Oh, it's still here. There it is. Bunsen burner. Authentication code word, Impish. Vault 88 emergency classification. Unspecified integrity breach warning. 
any available vault tech personnel so yeah this not this church that I'm seeing on the map there's some kind of schoolhouse or something over that way on the map let's see something over there oh crap I fell off there's nothing up here I can get is there I'm gonna jump yeah nothing up there this is an emergency broadcast signal from vault 88 authentication code word impish is that the school? Yeah, that is a school. Okay, that's the one that has the experiment with the freaking paste. Some kind of pink freaking paste food that everybody was supposed to eat. Oh, 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 there's a behemoth over there. Oh, 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 oh. Where'd it go? I just seen it. There it is. There's a freaking bohemoth over there. I want to go get. Where's that other ghoul? Where did ghoul go? Where's this right here? I am losing freaking dead people. I am the opposite. Opposite of the sixth sense. I don't see dead people. I can't find the freaking dead people. Ah, oh, it was just right here. There he is. All right, Bohemoth. Hey, dude. Authentication code word. Impish. Vault Hey. Ancient Bohemoth. Oh, ow. Threw rocks at me. Hey. Well, he's got all kinds of stuff on him. Death claw meat. This is an emergency broadcast signal from Vault 88. Nothing I really want. Code word, Except for the ammo that I took. Oh, oh, he's been busy over here. Clobber and ghouls. Any available vault tech personnel are required to respond under emergency protocol VT76. This signal will repeat. Massachusetts School District. That school districts were more <laughs> county <laughs> things instead of state things. This You don't have a whole statewide school district, do you? Maybe Massachusetts does because it's a smaller state. California goes by counties. There's actually three school districts just in the area that I live in. Fresno County School District, Clovis School District, and Central. Central Unified School District. And there's two more of them up in the mountains real close by. Well, I didn't mean to go in here unless there's some... I guess there's a magazine in here I can get. I don't want to go in here right now. I'll come back. This is an emergency broadcast signal from Vault 88. Authentication code word, Impish. I just wanted to get it on my map. Okay, we're going Vault this way. Oh, Brad's. Emergency classification. Unspecified integrity breach warning. Any available vault tech personnel Getting close. are required to respond under emergency More freaking rads. Maybe. Maybe not. What just happened? Is this the quarry? This is that freaking other quarry. It's in the quarry? This is an emergency broadcast signal. Who are they shooting at? I probably should have came to this quarry from the other direction. Any available vault tech personnel are required to respond under emergency protocol VT7. This signal will repeat. Still kicking? 
Ow. Hey, that is the church where my graphics, yeah, made everything purple. Yeah, I know. I went and checked it after that. That's why I knew that I'd been there before. Because even after after you seen that, I went to check it just to see if your if it was your graphics or something to do with mine or, or something to do with the game. I mean, yeah, you know. gray baseball bat. But I'm carrying too much. Luckily, Val can carry 500 pounds. Haha. <laughs> Any available Vault Tech personnel are required to respond under emergency protocol BT76. Wow, we got a pile of girls here. Most times that wouldn't be a problem, but they're all dead. They're no fun if they're dead. Oh, shit blowing up. I don't remember that happening before. Authentication code word. Impish. Vault 88 emergency classification. Unspecified integrity breach warning. Any available Vault Tech personnel. I don't see any more under emergency protocol people markers. This signal will repeat. I'm getting ratted. I'm getting rads. There's a lot of rads down here. Oh, there's one. It's a people marker. Two of them. They're under me. Let me go over here first. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, crap. Oh, oh, she just jacked freaking Evo up. That was a, that was a cool move. I like some of these moves that they do. Somebody up here? There's two more under me still. Oh, they're hugging. Isn't that sweet? This is an emergency broadcast Damn. signal from Vault 88. Authentication code word Impish. Vault 88 emergency classification. Unspecified integrity breach warning. I'm getting some rads. Vault Tech personnel are required to respond under emergency protocol VT76. This signal will repeat. I wish there was a way Got it. to advertise normally on this is an emergency on a uh, from Vault eighty eight. Authentication code word Impish. YouTube. Vault eighty eight emergency. I'd love to do I wish I would have actually been paying attention. I, I was kind of during the middle of the freaking month. I was pay, trying to pay attention to when the mod was coming out, and it never freaking showed up. And I got tired of waiting. Okay, where's Val? I'm over encumbered here. I want to give her my stuff. I just. I then I forgot all about that it was coming out and I wasn't paying attention. 
If I would have been paying attention, it would have been cool to advertise a couple days ahead of time for my stream, saying that I was going to play it on such and such date. The new... Especially when Nuke World comes out. Nuka, Wor Nuka World? Where is Val? Just seen somebody moving around over that way. Is that her? Where is she? Here you are. Hey, 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 hey. This is an emergency broadcast from Vault 88. Hey. Authentication over. Get this. Vault 88 emergency classification. Unspecified integrity breach warning. Hey. Available Vault Tech personnel are required to respond to Slayer. emergency protocol BT76. This signal will repeat. Rocket launcher. See if she she can find some freaking rockets for that thing and use it. Oh, it's mostly all this power armor a bit. It's weighing me down. Screw that. We'll just give her all the junk. This is an emergency broadcast signal from Vault 88. Authentication code word oh. Impish. Vault 88 emergency classification. Unspecified. I got me down pretty good. Any available Vault Tech personnel are required to respond under emergency protocol BT76. This signal will be. So the vault is underneath this place. I was wondering about this. Uh, earlier in the this playthrough, I mentioned that I've never actually checked this place out before. That I passed by it. I passed by it and shot a few people from the outside, but I never came into it. And this this playthrough is the first time that I've been inside here. And after I was was done, I mentioned how disappointed I was with the place. What you got going? Oh, you got that big old freaking sword thing going on, huh? You think you're a freaking Klingon? Um, but yeah, I was kind of disappointed in it. It just just didn't seem like there was enough to it. Like both of the other two quarries have a lot going on. God, look at all the rads I'm getting now. I'm standing right next to those two barrels. More than two barrels, huh? What, you can't even get in this thing? What, what, what happened? Here it goes. Here it is. There's the door. Yeah, I knew that there was something weird going on when I was here before. This is an emergency broadcast signal from Vault 88. Oh wait, no, this is the door I just went... Did I just go through this a minute? Nope, here we go. I don't think that was here last time I was here. I don't even know if this whole tunnel was even here. Oh, where does this go to? Right to here. Oh. Dang, I need... Some... Right away. Look at my face. That is not a pretty face. Alright. Get through this rad section real quick. Where's the door? There it is. I'm away from the rads. Whoa, I'm in! I needed to save first. I was trying to get away from the rads so I could save. Oh no. I hope... hope it saves for me or there gives me a chance to save once I'm in here. Crap. Cease at once. 
Yes, I can save. Leave at once. Ooh, scary voice. Won't be at my keyboard. Yeah. What am I doing? Oh, overriding, yeah. The vault doors were meant to withstand a direct nuclear strike. Your attempts to breach this facility are laughable. Leave at once, or there will be consequences. Whoever you are, stop. Ooh, the shot fell in the back. I'm gonna be sick. Vault Tech will not forgive this vandalism. We're not forgive that vandalism. I just killed them all. What are you talking about? When will you tire of this futility? That does not sound like a normal person. She's like freaking. What was that that dude on Dudley Do Right? Just stop already. Snidely Whiplash. There you go. It's a female version of Snidely Whiplash. <laughs> I'll get you, Dudley Do Right. Oh, that's Dudley Do Right's voice, huh? Dud my name is Dudley Do Right. I'll get you. No, that's just a mean black voice. I get you, sucker. I don't know. She sound like a freaking woman, Dudley Do Right, or <laughs> Snidely Whiplash. Can I get this fucking straight? Excuse me. Okay, let's go in and find out what's going on here, because I can get in here. Let me save again. I think I can get in here. I have the means. I wonder if it's an automated voice. What? You have a pit boy? Wait. Are you Foltek? Have you finally come to save me? Yep. That's Please. what I'm here to do. I'm trapped behind a mountain of rubble. The key to freeing me is getting the workshop operational. First, lift the security lockdown and get to the reactor room. Right. Better living underground. Can you read that? Lift the security lockdown. Someone's trapped inside Vault 88. Needs help. She's asked me to lift the security lockdown so I can get inside the reactor area where I should find a control board. Alright. It's been hard to maintain the faith. So many years ooh, ooh. stranded here. But you can assure Dr. Braun, if he's even still around, that I have used the time productively. The great work is ready to begin. Damn, how <laughs> come I... Stop running around! Oh, there's something behind me. Oh God! Look at all the blood. I think it was Mia shooting me in the ass. Wow! Lots of ghouls in this place. What did that say? Generous something? Generous. That's a charred one. Holt 88 jumpsuit. Pip boys. 
There's 10 freaking Pip Boys in here. What? And 10 jumpsuits. And I need to turn on my light. Pip Boy Crate. Pip Boy added. Are they like fancier Pip Boys or something? Oh, Darcelin. Hello, Danny Boy. Oh, Danny Boy. The pipes, the pipes are calling. If you want to see something really, 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 really funny, go to my channel, go to the videos, and go down and keep going to the bottom, and then uh, it'll say something like, you know, see more or reveal more or more videos or something. Keep going down until you find my very first set of videos that I ever made on YouTube a couple years ago, about two and a half years ago or so. The second or third video is called something like Farewell to Pony something, I don't know. And in that video, I fucking sing that song, Danny Boy. It is the funniest fucking thing ever. Excuse my language, but yeah. I sang Danny Boy in the song or in the video and didn't get a copyright violation because I didn't know about copyright violations back then. But I didn't get a copyright violation because I sang it myself and it is a public domain song if you sing it yourself. If you don't have Bing Crosby singing it for you. So, yeah. Um, what am I doing? I'm looking for... Pip boy. Pip boy, not there. Uh, Pip boy, not here. Why wouldn't it be in apparel? Oh, there. No, that's a jumpsuit. Why wouldn't a Pip boy be in apparel? Pip boy here. There it is, Pip Boy. It's a real Pip Boy, but why is it in miscellaneous? And how, you can't use it? What is it good for? It doesn't have any value, but it weighs something. Hmm. Yes. Pit boy crate. Take Pit boy. Those are like the Pit boy crates that you get. The Pit boy pack. My son has one. The Fallout Pit boy edition packs. They look like Pit boy crates like that. Or they come in Pit boy crates, and it's a Pit boy thing that you can hook up to a regular Pit boy thing that you can hook your phone up to and he had to get a certain phone when he got renewed his phone when he redone his phone he, had, he got a, made sure that he got the right kind of phone that'll fit inside the freaking pit boy right <laughs> the right size I guess but certain sizes that won't fit like he had a real big fancy ass phone before that that wouldn't fit. Dang. Where am I going? That way, I guess. Let me go this way first, then. I don't know. I, I could go this way and it send me back around that way. Requires a terminal. Oh. So, yeah, this is the only way I can go, it looks like. How about this one? 
Yeah, that one requires a terminal also. Screening. That's where I just came from. Ain't it? Yes. Well, there's a the terminal. This is a pretty clean looking place too, except for it's got papers on the ground and stuff. Lots of purified water. And cigarettes. Undamaged cigarettes even. Woohoo. Mess up my lungs again. I already messed up my lungs enough in my lifetime. All right, here we are. <sighs> Do you realize how many videos it is going through to get there? <laughs> I think I got 400 and something videos. I think, you know what? It might be easier if you went to my playlist and look for van freedom season one playlist and just start it because it'd be in the first couple videos <laughs> and that might actually be down in the main channel page down at the bottom where it says van freedom videos or van freedom freedom playlists or something um danny boy i heard someone got a copyright violation for singing the song exactly how it sounds, eh, well, if they did get a copyright violation for singing that song, they should have fought it because that song is an old Irish folk song. I don't know if you remember me, Daniel Demore. Hey, yeah, I remember you from way back when I first did my first Fallout series. Hey, Captain's here too. What's up? Hi, pal. If you guys want your fan art, you're going to have to send me a Twitter link or something that I can send the art to you. I already told you about this with me. The only way you're going to get it to me is if you put it on a... Dropbox. Put it in a Dropbox or something. And then just give me the link. Um, you can put the link in the, the, the description, but you can't just... You can't put a link in the description, but you can put the address, if you know how, what you're doing, in the, or in the chat um, of one of my videos. Actually, I think you can actually put a link in... You can't put a link in the chat here, but if you go to the comments of my videos you can put a link in there but it will think of it as a um, spam and it'll put it in my spam box so it won't show up in public so nobody will see it unless you want them to see it and then I can actually flag it as not being spam and it'll put it right on my thing I've talked about this to you at least three times Dropbox, dropbox.com. Look it up. It gives it, they give you over two gigabytes worth of space. You can upload anything you want onto that Dropbox. Put it in the Dropbox. You can put videos, you can put games, you can put pictures, just regular any kind of files, and you put them on there, and then you send somebody the link. You say share. You click on the side over on the right, it'll say share. And once you hit share, it'll give you a link. And you just cut and paste that link somewhere, and then somebody can click on the link and they can get it. They'll be able to download it. So you can use it any time you want, you know, for, for anything you want. If you want to share share things with people. 
But yeah, when you first mentioned it way back a couple weeks ago about fan art, I was telling you you need to do that. You and then there was somebody else that was talking about it too. Um, two or three different people. And I mentioned that that Dropbox a lot. <laughs> Is this? No, I don't mean DeviantArt. It doesn't show the picture. It just shows files. If you upload something to Dropbox.com, you have to set, make an account. You have to make an account, and you op uh, upload load something to dropbox.com to your dropbox you can upload any kind of file any kind of computer file ever made <laughs> to that dropbox and people can download them and then they can look at them on their own computer they don't have to you know it's like DVR I think that is just shows pictures and stuff and I don't even know if you can download the pictures you can just look at them there I don't know I haven't messed with DVR a lot but I've seen pictures on there before they actually show the pictures and Dropbox it doesn't show anything it just shows the file file name and you click on it and you can download it but yeah okay let me check this terminal out lift security lockdown security logs let's check that out first confidential Confidential, confidential. Security eyes only. Violator, violation, blah, blah, blah. October 23rd. Wait. Okay. October 23rd, 2077. Or, two, yeah, 2077 is the day of the nuclear war. The day of the bombs. So, this is a month, two months before it almost. So, let's see what that says first. Finally, I got the real. Finally, got a real security system. I know the entrance is window dressing, but if Barstow keeps bringing the top brass around, it's my ass if something goes wrong. The construction crew keeps gripping, griping about the new security measures. They can complain all they like. I think that they were actually trying to make this vault. If it started, it looks like it started two months before the war. So they were in the process of making this vault when the war hit. So it never got finished. I'm pretty sure that's what's going on. And you could finish it yourself. That's, I think that's probably part, part of the whole thing. Okay, October 22nd. This is the day before the bombs fell. Barso's coming tomorrow. Another dog and pony show. Entrance is finally properly done. So if she brings VIPs as long as they stick to that section, it'll feel like a real vault. So this is all that's in the vault. And apparently Barstow's probably the person I'm talking to. And she's a freaking ghoul trapped in there for 2,000 2, 2, years. 2,000 years. She was around when Christ was alive. No, 200 years. Let's get this straight. Um, turns out the construction boys aren't so bad. Been having a friendly poker game. From the way things are going, they're going to be here a good long, long while. Got visited, got invited to some Halloween party. God knows we could use a little excitement around here. All right. And the bomb. Automatic, automated security lockdown. Nuclear detonation event. Detected, de detected. Well, they just didn't spell that right. I don't think that's how you spell it, is it? <laughs> Unless I'm completely fucked up. I can't read good anyway. I have a freaking bad problem reading out loud. And when they misspell shit, <laughs> it really screws me up. Okay, automated Volt Tech emergency lockdown procedure initiated.
Uh, I think I can figure it out. Baby Guy Kim. Keem? Bad, oh, Bad Guy Keem. Eighth grade is going to be a long year. Eighth grade? Oh, you're... Oh, it's summertime now, yeah. You're just going to start eighth grade next year, or this coming semester. Oh, I didn't turn off the security lockdown, did I? There we go. Fine. Good. Very control board. Vault Tech workshops require their control board to function. During emergencies, the procedure is to store it in the reactor room. Look in there and you should find it. Oh, they open this. And there's not much in here. Oh, there's a dead guy, though. And his helmet. Hey, you remember these places, don't you, Val? You grew up in one of these, didn't you? Oh. Something just moved. Oh, crap! Oh, man, he's... Security chief. He was the security chief. Control board. Repair the Vault Tech workshop. Sprinter's leg. Oh, okay. Well, actually, that's pretty good for a freaking leg. Huh. Let me check that. It's not as good as what I have. This left leg. Where's the left leg? Left leg. I've got 1928. And this one is 1522. I bet you if I upgraded it, it'd be close. But this one has perception and agility, so it's probably better in the long run to keep it. But yeah, so you got, um, Captain, you got the fan art done? That's pretty cool. I want to see what it looks like. Black room glasses. Radio beacon. Attention people of the Commonwealth. Vault 88 is now accepting applications for the first time in 200 years. Vault Tech's motto has never been more applicable. I can't hear that. Better living underground. Vault 88 is conveniently located near downtown Quincy. Apply in person to Overseer Barstow. Uh, I can't hear a thing that she said. Sounds like an advertisement for the vault. Vault Tech Radio Beacon. Radio Freedom. Oh, that's the castle radio station. Attention, people of the Commonwealth. Vault 88 is now accepting applications for the first time in 200. Said Vault Tech is now accepting applications for the first time. Is my. Controls. No. Display. Subtitles is on. Maybe because it's a new thing, they screwed up and didn't put subtitles on it. Oh, because it's a radio station. They don't have subtitles. Okay, it sounds like they're advertising for the vault. It didn't turn off. They're advertising for the vault. It's saying that they're taking applications for it. From the public. That's what it sounds like, at least.
vault tech workbench. Oh, cool. Oh, hey. Hey, get your fat ass out my way. Um. Clear the rubble. Someone trapped inside the vault needs our help. Got the workshop operational and now should clear rubble until I can rescue the stranger. I'm pretty sure that's who it is. It's that girl that it was talking about in here. Defenses. No defenses. People one. Food zero. Water. No water. Lots of power. And one bed. So we could tell this isn't a whole vault. If there's only one bed in it. Scrap. Just steel? There's a lot more than steel in there. Just give me steel. That's not good. Yep. Look at it. It's... Oh, there's freaking more than one ghoul in here. Oh, oh, she's in living in here with regular ghouls. I wonder if they're bad guys. Let me see. Julian. They, they got names. What about that one over there? No. Yeah. They're going to try to attack me. I know that. Yeah. It's a big construction site. Overseer Barstow. Yep. Boy, she's skinny. Look how skinny she is. I bet you she'd look real funny up against Val. Come here, Val. Come here. Val. Ah. You aren't what I was expecting. You aren't you what I was expecting. Boy. You're from a vault. But you're clearly not with Waltec. What are you doing here? Why did you help me? Radio beacon. I'm interested in you. Sarcasm. Doing the right thing. The right thing to do. There we go. It was the neighborly thing to do. Such a fine sense of civic duty. Very laudable. My name is Valerie Barstow. And I was to be the overseer of this vault. But please. God, she looks funny. Me. I have a proposal for you. Oh, no, no, no proposals, please. No. I was given a tour of what was to be my pride and joy. My vault. Then the earthquakes. Sirens. Many died. Perhaps they were lucky. Oh, crap. What are you doing? I'm sorry. The construction crew didn't fare as well as me. They've never done anything hostile towards me, though. It's probably best if you put them out of their misery. Okay. I could do that. Kill the feral ghouls. Well, oh, there's more. Wow, you're slow. Oh, crap. All of them? There's one more somewhere. Shot me. It's over for now. I can't really even jump up in these things, can I? I'm not too good. There we go. Let me try this one. I made it. Empty. There's empty chests. 
Wow, this is all the stuff to make a bolt vault. And let me see what happens when I try to scrap it. Well, wait. Store? No. Actually, yeah. Let me store that one. Okay, I want to... Scrap the train. It's only 30 freaking steel, though. What? This is, like, messed up. That It's like all this stuff. There's wood and probably some plastic in here. And you can't get any of this, but you can scrap the whole freaking train car for 30 steel. That is not a lot of steel for that whole freaking train car in the first place. With er everything in it, that's even worse. Um get out of there. I don't want to scrap anything else yet. Um, I'll look up inside this train car if I can get up there. So far, everything that I've scrapped, I only got steel for it. How are you supposed to build anything in here if that's all you freaking can get is steel? I tried digging my way to the entrance. With that control board, I could have changed everything. But there was simply too much rubble for the equipment to handle. But my work kept me going. Here, your work kept you going people, for 200 years. This is my life's work. I'd like to share it with you. Dr. Braun tasked me with something vital. A series of prototypes and their related, well, experiments that could redefine society. But, as you can see, things did not go according to plan. What experiments? I'm listening. Tough break. Vault techs are bastards. Yep. Um, what experiments? What are these experiments? Ingenious devices that will improve the efficiency and health of a community. They are admittedly prototypes and may have a design flaw or two, but nothing that can't be fixed with some elbow grease. Damn it. I'm trying to get a good screenshot of her. I'm listening. Who's Dr. Braun? Yeah, let's try that one. You mentioned Dr. Braun? Who is he? Dr. Braun is the head of the Societal Preservation Plan. A brilliant scientist and administrator. And, no doubt, dead. A tremendous loss. Uh, I need to turn off the... Oh, yeah. I need to turn off the subtitles for a minute. So I can get a screenshot of her. Okay, I'm listening. Go on then. This vault was meant to be spacious, full of trained staff, trusted subordinates and scientists, despite how... Hey, I got a good screenshot. I think that'll work. ...things have played out. I see opportunity. Let us work together as partners. Opportunity. She wants to complete the vault. And what good is it? The war's over. What's my role? Never work with Vault Tech. I'll never work with Vault. The Vault Tech isn't history. It's no more. What's my role? I recognize that you are in a superior bargaining position. I'll handle the mundane nuts and bolts of vault management. Anything you want, I'm happy to accommodate. All I ask is you run the prototype experiments. I want to know what these freaking experiments actually are. Uh, yeah, I guess I'm doing it. Let's do this, then. Good. Excellent. We cannot begin until I have my overseer's desk to run the experiments. The information in the desk's terminal will prove vital. I entrust you with the future of our vault. 
Vault 88. Build Vault. The overseer's desk. And where do I put it? And I want to know what these experiments are. North section. Oh, it's pointing me over to here. Inside. Let me see first where I'm supposed to be going. Should be like a... Oh. That's just to build it. I can do that without going there. Just want to look at the rest of this area. See what else is in here. Ooh, what the hell is that? It's a wrecking ball? Maybe. There's an that's not no freaking wrecking ball. That looks just like that. Kinda. Yeah. <laughs> She's trying to run through it. Looks like they were building something there. Ooh, hey. Nothing in these. Where she's been sleeping. Crams. Okay, I think I've got all the loot. Wait. I did check around her, didn't I? No, I guess not. Right, I guess I it's about scrapping this place. All about scrapping it now. Poor Julian. I had to put him out of his misery. Special, probably. There it is. This is the original type of overseer's desk in in Fallout Three and Fallout New Vegas. They have these type of overseer's desks. In this game, they don't have this type of desk in the overseer's offices. They have those just those wooden desks these kind if you ever play fallout 3 or new vegas most times these will lift up out of the ground and there will be a secret tunnel underneath and that's what was my idea when i made volt 44 in the first place is to do something like that but i couldn't make it work because it wasn't in this game and this kind of sucks now that they put it in um I don't know where you're supposed to put this. There's really no place for it yet. Got to make a freaking overseer's office. I'm going to leave that pole there. Hey, there's some concrete. 
And some wood. Why? Is there a water tower? Um, those lights aren't really working, are they? Skeleton. Bones. Hey, cool. Oh, that's the train. S steel, leather, and cloth. Oh, that was more than was in that last one. Scrap. Rubber tracks. And wood. Steel and wood. And that's as far that way as you can go. It doesn't look like you can... The, the vault that you make has to fit inside this area a bit. I guess you, could, guess you could have some rooms going off into these little tunnels, too. You know what? I'm going to save the water tower. Wait. No, I can make other water. Is this reactor core? Hmm. Whoa. That's the end of the area. Looks like there's something going on in there, though. Uh, let me scrap. What, what can you get with this? Nuclear material. A lot of good stuff. Apparently, you're going to be able to make a reactor core. Vault Tech Super Reactor Platform. I probably shouldn't have scrapped that. Can you move these? No. I guess you gotta scrap them. They'll probably let you make. You're gonna have to make some kind of reactor. I'm sure. There's a, a nuclear reactor that you can make from the last DLC. So maybe you can use that one too. If you go to power. Generators. Okay, that's the one that you could make already. And here's a new one. And here's the super one. Wow, 500. Needs. Oh, I almost got all the stuff. It needs uh, 100 of 200 nuclear materials. I mean, it needs 100 nuclear materials, then I have 20. What am I freaking thinking? I just gibber on. Don't know what I'm saying half the time. Jibber jabber. 
Whoa! Oh! Opened up a whole new area. And more going on that way. But it's out of the building area. them lights. Oh. What are we going to do with all these freaking um, ghouls laying around? Got to build over them? Oh, let me check over here real quick. Huh. That's pretty cool. Have to go exploring in a minute. What the hell? Okay, is this going to store everything if I do this? Nope. <laughs> Didn't think so. Dang it. Store. Scrap. Scrap. I could scrap that one. hell ooh there was stuff in there I didn't even think of looking at that footlocker it stored it whatever it was oh oh crap everything fell I was trying to get everything out of it before I did that so I didn't have to look on the freaking ground for it Something fell. Sorry, this is going to take a while. Oh, hey, here's the whole vault. Cave entrance. Evacuation, evacuation. Construction material and person personnel delivery was from those tunnels. Um, evacuation, evacuation, oh, ex excavation, damn it, see, there goes my freaking reading crap again, okay, that one tunnel goes to the reactor room, 
that I wasn't able to get in there, was I? Oh, no, I did get in there. Okay. I was just in a room, though. I wasn't in the actual reactor area. Oh. Oh, well. Looks like I got most of it. Oh, another whole area. North section. That's where it says excavation. I kept saying evacuation. Oh, wait. I shouldn't get rid of any of the wall panels. because I could use those as a base. That floor is messed up. These floors kind of are intact. If they'll line up with the floor over there, though, they might not. Let's see if I can move it. Yeah! All right. store this one. Is there anything in it first? Wait. Oh, that one's the empty one. Store that and use it as a whole. Because once you when you scrap something, you don't get as much material out of it as you do when you're when you have the whole piece, you know, when you go to make something. Um, it costs you more material to make something than it does when you, than you get when you scrap it. So it's not really good to scrap everything. That which I was doing. It's kind of stupid of me. Some of the stuff, if I can save it, like a first aid kit would be good if I could have saved that. Some of the stuff I could should store. There we go. Store. That I could store. I don't even know what good that is to store some of that crap. Yeah. Looks like I got everything. Oh, there's a sign in the middle of the road here. I wonder if I move this, right, the debris goes with it. Debris disappears when you move it. But problem is, I think, so when I go to move something else in that place, the breeze is going to come back, ain't it? Maybe not. Or did I just move that right here? Huh. Some of the debris came back.
Damn it. Why the hell did I just freaking scrap? I wonder how far this way I can go in this mode. Wow. You can go all through this place. All the way to the entrance. This is probably getting a little boring. I should probably do the story line and then come back. What? I can't even scrap these things, the pit boys. Finish the story line and then I can come back off screen and scrap everything and re and build a little. I can build a little bit of it on camera, but. That's after I know what I'm doing a little bit more, I think. Can't even grab that one, that case. Okay, it said that the reactor room is here. That is a reactor. That's the only reactor? You can't move the walls. You could scrap some things in here and put an extra reactor in here. It would be cool if you can open up these walls, put a couple more reactors, but I guess this is all the power that you need to run the whole thing. Maybe. Depends on what, you, how much stuff you put in that needs power, I guess. So I don't know where the overseer's office is supposed to be. I guess you can put it wherever you want. Um, overseer's office is usually higher. This is says um, atrium floor and the atrium it's usually the part that has the big vaulted ceilings the big a-frame ceilings and the overseer's office is usually connected to it And it's up a couple levels. So what kind of building supplies we have here? Metal, concrete, warehouse, barn, vault, scaffolding, box cars, horse fences, elevator. Miscellaneous. Uh, ball track. Oh, okay, that was for for the uh, contraptions. Okay, vault. Domestic utility. Wide rooms. I know most of this stuff just from building my vault. Atrium. See, that's a big vaulted ceiling right there. Doors, railings, supports. This is what they're probably meant to be building right in here somewhere. Oh, I want to go under the ground. I guess I need to put a floor in first. Oh, wait, oh, wait, oh. what just happened? Oh, there we go. Wow. And it's going this direction. That way, or that way.
got to figure out where I'm going to put the friggin' overseer's office so I can put the desk in. Looks like the bit widest area is over that way. Problem is, I'm going to have to put a f more floor in before I do this. Got that kind. Got that kind. That's one side, and this is the other. Um, middle, wait, it's different types. What's the difference? Oh, this isn't high, this high. Okay, and that's just the A-frame part of it. There's the floors, the walls. The overseer's window. I guess I could just put her desk. I can always move it later. Let me just freaking do the minimal for now. Let's just put her desk here so she could she can start working on it later. Wait a minute. Let's uh dang it. Clear the debris off of this. I guess um dude's gotta stay there. Ceiling floor, ceiling, column trim, prefab walls, or it's just the freaking floor. Did I already pass it? Plain old floor, there we go. I don't even know if this is going to line up with this. Let me see how close they lined those up. It doesn't... Oh, nope, it doesn't line up. Yeah. Okay. Now let's line it up. It's so much easier to build it this way than in the creation kit. Okay, at least it's lined up with that floor now. I'm gonna put just put her thing. You know what? Let me put two more floors or three more. Put her desk right in the middle. If these guys had move. Let's not even straight. There we go. That's straight. Finally, my overseer's desk and the proper Volt Tech terminal. So what now? Model citizen returned to the overseer. Chairs turned around the wrong way. Oh, hey, it turns. Well, that is pretty cool. 
<laughs> probably see what's this. on her freaking computer. Please, I beg your indulgence. I've waited so long, but we must not dally. The work compels us. The vault was supposed to have a very specific set of residents. After all, to conduct human trials, you need the perfect test subjects. Perfect test subjects. Want to leave. Find a guinea pig. Won't hurt anybody. So what makes perfect test subjects? Healthy. Well, healthy enough. And people we can get an accurate baseline on quickly. And they need a willingness to take on a certain element of risk. I'm not going to toy with people's lives. Think of the greater good here. But fine. You're running the experiments. If you choose a risk-free path, it will compromise the value of the research. But that's on your head. Choose wisely. Now, turn on the vault's Her radio. Her skin region. looks funny. Certainly people above ground would give anything to live in our vault. Okay. While we wait for word to spread, perhaps you might use this time to explore Vault 88. If you can clear some of the rubble, you may be able to access some of the other building sectors. Any materials or equipment that survived may prove useful in our experiments. All right. Turn on the Voltec radio beacon. Us to get residents. We. It's gonna be hard to freaking build with people running around in here. With the overseer set up, the next step is turning on the radio beacon to attract people. All right. See what time it is. I have no clue. Still early. Yep. I think I want to work on building this place before I get people in here. I it, I wish I could clear this debris out more. make this a wider o opening but this stuff's high enough that I can get how many stories is that one two three I can get at least four stories right in this area maybe even five but I don't know I think that ceiling's too low for the fifth in, in places at least for the fifth level and this atrium area goes up at least three levels here but over on this side you can get up to one two three four it looks like all up in here not gonna be able to get back up in here except for maybe some storage rooms okay I want to see what's down these tunnels that's what I want to check out I've seen on one of the trailers of this mod fighting some rad roaches and stuff. So there's going to be some enemies around. Yep, there's enemies around. There's a, some big areas that they freaking opened up down here. It looks like these were originally uh, subway tunnels. Oh, I didn't want that. Ammo. Hell yeah. East sector. Ooh, there's rads down there. 
Which way is east? This is east. Maybe you can actually open up and build more. That That's what I needed to open up the... Uh, the workbench. So maybe there's ex other workbenches so you can open up other areas and build more. All right, this has got a lot of rads. Let me take freaking rad X before I go in there. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Why is this thing radiated in here? Oh, 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 oh. I'm gonna be sick. That's a badass looking Meyer alert. Oh, 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 bunches of them. Ooh, ooh, is that a queen? Yep, here it is. Yeah. So you can build more in here. Cool. What? Explore Volt 88. Turn on Vault Tech Workshops in the northeast sector, the east sector, the north sector. So I did three different sectors. That was the parts on the map. I should have left that freaking map alone that said um, ex excavation in them. There was three different areas, and this is one of them this way. How do you link them all together? If I wonder if that means that you can go through the tunnels now, um, building stuff through the tunnels, or how do you link this section with that section if you can't go through the tunnels? Unless you can go through the walls now. You know what? Let me see something. Still has one people. So yeah, see it open this up. I can go all the way into here now. So I can... I can't scrap this though. I can scrap this other crap. But, but yeah. I can build a hallway. Running all the way through here. Turning this way. I'll get rid of all this concrete. And all this crap, too, along the way. Most of it, at least. Enough to get into here and build another tunnel all the way this way. And this is, um, looks like a water system. Do I, 
It says zero water. Can you turn this thing on somehow? Requires power. We gotta, if I gotta link the power to here, and then we'll get a hundred water. So link the power from that other sector over to here somehow. And this could be like a maintenance area with the water. Can I get over here? Yeah. With the water treatment plant area. Oh! Oh, you scared the piss out of me. All right, so that's cool. See, Danny boy. Good night, everyone. Oh, man, I missed a bunch of stuff, huh? You guys are going on about something. There's more people came on. Oh, you deleted a bunch of stuff from him, huh? Bradley. He must have been going on. Hey, is Mountain Dew on too? How did I miss so much? Man, I haven't been paying attention. Sorry about that, guys. Go into the discussion and click on my link. Okay, I'm going to have to check that out. Mountain Dew, I missed you. Sorry. God, I missed a lot. Fluffy's boyfriend is was weed eating for us and broke the head off of his... Off of his what? So we owe him a weed eater. He broke the head off. He broke his head off. Must be a bad day for weed eaters. Okay, yeah, I missed a bunch here. Sorry, guys. I'm going to go to the end. I'm going to skip through a lot of this. Um, just want to see who's been on. Wow. Missed a lot of this. Got to get going. Have to get up early to take hubby to his doctor. Hope your back feels better. Probably missed do, but bye. And Brady. Ain't no Brady Bunch if he's cussing like that, huh? And... Yeah, I missed a bunch there. Dang, I missed a lot of the chat. Sorry, guys. And we got a few new people here. Lopez Garcia, what's up? And Fresh Lyrics, what's up? Welcome to the stream, guys. Why did you say... Why did you say my name? Sub me? What? Okay, so this is the northeast area. How much? Nope, I can't can't get into construction mode yet. What? 
Looks like I'm going to have to make an elevator or something to come down this one. Oh, crap. More rat. Let's do this. Oh, where'd he go? It's under the ground. You're shooting in the wrong spot. <laughs> she was shooting in the hole after he went down in there. Like, yeah, you're going to really hit him now. I gotta not scrap these pieces like this because I can move them afterwards. I need to find the circuit board and the workbench. See, look, look, they started building stuff here. They actually got stairs going up. A residence area. This was supposed to be a res residence quarter, looks like. Dang. Oh, God. Where's the other one? There he is. Let's see if they have anything good inside of them. Nope, they didn't need anything good. It's ever a gold watch. My red X wore off. Yeah, it looks like they were starting to build a residence quarters area in here. If you go up here, the wallpaper is different than most. This is like residence area wallpaper, I think. Oh, that was real good. How am I going to get out of here now? Oh, there we go. I seen something in the trailer where you're actually blasting some stuff too. So I think you can break, like finish clearing this out. They didn't finish clearing this out yet. And Maybe one floor of stuff can fit in here. You know what? I gotta get this, that stuff out. Northeast sector. And there's the. Nope. Where's the circuit board? It's a dead guy. Somebody was drinking whiskey back up in here. Oh! Damn it, I should have freaking reloaded. Rads. Whoa. There'll be rads in here. I better take another rad X. your blood I think you were the one that was bleeding oh what's this this might be another entrance from the outside there's a circuit board hell yeah 
Now I just got to find the... I don't, I don't think I've seen the... It's down, it says. What's up here? Yeah, I don't think I've seen... Oh, wait. Something's going on here. Oh, crap. Hey, dude. Well, you're an ugly sucker. Oh, oh, you mutated, huh? Lucky you ain't got no legs. justice for you. Lucky combat shotgun. Shotgun! Oh, why am I crouched? So what was I saying? I haven't found a um, workbench yet. Is it up here? I think there's going to be another entrance this way. Make a secret, secret entrance. Actually, a lot of this stuff I need to take back. If I if I can't, if you can't open up this area to build stuff in, you could at least scrap it, everything in here or take everything. Nope, no way to get out. Or what's behind there? There's freaking peep. Or there was red marks there for a second. One way to find out is to get into console mold mode and just go right through it. Find out where I'm at. I don't know, maybe I could scrap that later. Oh. Which way did I, I came in? This no. Came in this way, right? Yeah. It's going to a whole nother section. Northeast section? Oh, that's... Oh, we're overlooking the area right now that I was just in. Huh. Let's go back down and see if I can find the workbench. That's it right there. Was I actually in this area? I don't think so. Huh. Nope, I wasn't in here. Hell, this freaking place is huge. What? Am, where am I? Oh, this is the north sector right here. So the northeast sector and the north sector kind of are connected. I don't know which circuit board this sector is. Can I? I can't use it on that, can I? Oh, yeah, I can. I'm 
Right. I think I've missed a circuit board somewhere. Probably passed it. Oh crap. I don't know what was inside that, but it got transferred to the workbench. Scrap it. There we go. Gonna get the major stuff out of the way. Oh, there we go. This is a section we were in earlier. Oh, crap. No, it's not. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. I'm. That's a tough one. Oh, another one. Stop it, stop it, stop it. Get out of my face. Get out of my face. Get out of my face. Oh, oh another one, another one. Oh, big one. Not Mia. She's on her ass. <laughs> I think I need to take everything out of these things so I can use them for supplies. Like the that radiation material that I got out of that one. That's what I needed for something earlier oh more whoa ow Ooh, that's a legendary I need my other freaking gun Oh, he even got Val on her ass. Fuck, he's a tough one. This Val's pretty freaking tough. Did I already... Yeah, these are the ones I already got. Reduces damage while standing and not moving. Yeah. It's limestone. You could use it for concrete. This is opening us up back to that other area. Yep. Cool. That's what I saw in the trailer, is scrapping those big walls like that, so you can open up areas. Thought it was would make more sense if you could actually use, like, dynamite or something. This is back to the first area that we were in in this section. It was right there. So we can link that section with this section. all the way through and all the way back to the main section and then there's the north section over this way I've still got to find one more 
circuit board for it. This section doesn't look as big as the rest of the sections. out of control board and that is this way 75 more yards looks like a mole rat tunnel It's like a subway. For now. Radiated subway. Yep, it was a subway. I didn't think of this. Um, these, this has barrels in it. Once we open up this area, I could probably scrap the barrels and get rid of the radiation. And there's no way to get out of the subway. So this could be part of the vault, probably. Oh, crap! Scared me. Where's he at? Where's he at? Fuck it. <laughs> Scared the piss out of me. Oh, give me a freaking heart attack. Research test tubes. I I got to remember. I need to scrap all of, or not scrap loot. All of the bad guys. So another tunnel back. You know what? Let me go get the. the circuit board over here. Let's find this wall or what? Yeah, right there. Yeah, with all these freaking radiation barrels, we kind of screwed up to build something in here. Oh, God. Oh, man. Oh. Oh, shit. Man, that wasted me. It was my own fault. The stupid gun that I got right here. Gun is okay for a little bit of range, but close up, it's <laughs> screwed up. I gotta put it in the th thing before I can scrap anything in here. Wonder how much is gonna actually be opened up once I start scrapping stuff. I need to go up those stairs or th that had the block on it earlier. Let's see if that's scrappable. Alright, let's head back.
Wait, I want to see what's through this other tunnel first. Captain the Gamer, retracted message, retracted message. Why? Because I can? <laughs> That's what he always says every time I ask him. Why? Why? Probably be able to scrap that. Oh, crap. Telephone. Why am I hiding? Am I back to the same area? Where am I? No. Different area. When they hit me for some for some reason it knocks me into sneak mode sometimes. I don't know how much of this place places like this you could actually build in, but I know that they're giving you all this scrappable stuff so that you'll have more supplies. Oh, hey! This is back into the main hall. Okay. This is all going to be linkable once I turn this thing on, I think. I could probably go through one of these walls to get to that other area also. Wow, seven rads right there. I really need to get rid of that rads stuff. That's the first thing I'm going to do once I turn this on is see if I can go to that area and get rid of those radiation barrels. Yeah. far in here you can go. You can go all the way in here. That's cool. Gone. That's still radiated for... It should go, though. Uranium. That was uranium. That's... Oh, that's why this place is ratted out, too, because there's freaking uranium around. Oh, for the nuclear materials you need for the re reactors and things like that. Cool. That other area that had a lot of radiation in it, I didn't look, but I bet you some of the rocks are green like that. And you can open that up to get in and out. What is this? The Commonwealth. Another entrance.
Yeah, I'm gonna have to really scrap the crap out of this place while I'm not <laughs> streaming. And I bet you... Oh, God. Whoop. Ha! <laughs> okay, maybe I can sneak in here and put some clothes back on, on her. I don't think it's going to work, but... Transfer. Whoop. That's not going to make it easy with a naked girl sitting here this long. Long Johns. Yep, you can't equip it. <laughs> to dead bodies. Oh, man. I'm going to have to turn her over somehow and throw something on top of her. Or get... Uh, I actually really need to just get into my um, body slider and put the never nudes things back on. That would help a lot. Any more radiation? More barrels? There's one. I'm going to get rid of all this radiation so that I don't freaking die every time I walk in this place. Okay, I'm good now. Look at all the radiation. Nope. There's still some... A lot of radiation around here. Odd. I don't see anything else. Maybe it'll go away over time. I'm hoping. Let's see if there's any other areas I can open up. more uranium. Maybe this green stuff right here, too. No. No. It's just moldy. There's some right there. I could see somebody going into this game, into this mod, or, oh, here we go. This is going to open it up. Yeah. Oh, crap. Death Claw. Death Claw. Ooh, legendary mystic Death Claw. He shot his legs off. Poor guy. Oh. Oh, I feel, almost feel sorry for him. Oh, oh, he keeps trying to get up. Let's shoot his other leg. Wait, I want to shoot his other leg off. Oh, that's just sad. That's just sad. I feel sorry for him. Oh, okay, put him out of his misery. I just felt bad for him. A lot of uranium here, though. Okay, I know this is going to be able to open up to the next area, to the other area somewhere. There we go. Yeah. This is back in the first area. Ain't it? Oh, this is back in the 
main part of the north area. Oh crap, no. <laughs> Man, I got a lot of suffrican a lot of suffrican a lot of supplies now. Can't get rid of these big blocks of granite or marble or whatever they are. That kind of sucks. That would give you extra concrete supplies. That's cool. Um, this all opens up now. If you maneuvered stuff around, you can make tunnels from one section to the next. Don't really need these lights. Looks like the lighting's actually built in. Maybe. Oh no, maybe not. It's my pit boy. Okay, see, I can get concrete out of this. And that. Northeast. Okay, yeah. This is the area that I wanted to see how far up I can go here, too. Wait, this is back to the beginning of the northeast. Wait. Yeah, this is where we came in at. And the stairways, I think, are over this way. Ooh, that opened that all up. To actually have to go around this thing build around that you can't go up any higher that kind of sucks You got nude mods on. Actually, I've had nude mods on. I just, um, before I did my mod, I had it all set up so that most of the nude stuff was covered up. I had this never nude bikini. So when, when you, uh, took the clothes off, the bikini would show up. But I had to uninstall all my mods so I could finish my mod. Well, that's confusing. But after I installed or uninstalled them, I had to reinstall them when I was ready to put it back put them back on. And when I reinstalled them, I didn't configure them right. And I haven't got around to doing it yet. I don't know why. I need to freaking get in there and do it and uh, get that. I, I noticed that on the first night that I didn't have that configured right. And I should have reconfigured it. I just haven't got around to doing it yet. So I've been busy doing other crap. Wish, wish you can get rid of all the debris. Unless you get rid of some of it. Select debris, but not all of it.
door. It's gone. Okay, this is a dead end. Yeah. All right. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. <laughs> Dude, come out. Come out. Oh, crap. Bad time to reload. He's charging me now. Ah, I gotta change guns before I can shoot again. This is too close. Damn, he just knocked her on her ass quick. Are you okay? Here, have a stim pack. Ugh! Wow. I can get into scrap mode up here. I don't even know where I'm at. Is this go out to the Commonwealth? Wow, I wonder what that entrance goes to. I'm going to find out in a second. Let me look on my map. Okay, where did I go into the vault at? I'm right above the entrance. Or right below the entrance. Above the entrance. I don't know. One of the two. What did I go in to get into the entrance in the first place? I can't remember, but more debris? Wait. Let me uh, see if I can scrap anything in here first. Nothing. Let me see. Can I get clear it? Some of it. I'll scrap all this stuff later. I just want to see if there's anything good. Buff out. Actually, I'm going to take all this stuff. Oh, crap! I forgot! Oh, God. I'm fucking stupid. I need to get all the stuff that I can possibly get, and I want to put it in the workbench so I can use, scrap it for later, you know? And I just keep forgetting. I'm going to have to fix that tonight, as soon as I get off. So I can't even look that way now. Okay. <laughs> Empty blood bags. I guess once I turn on that freaking beacon, I'll get people here. And I can link this place to Sanctuary. And once I link it to Sanctuary, I can use my materials from there. So really, I don't have to worry about materials a whole lot, I don't think. But, um... Okay, I'm over encumbered. Where's Val? Hey. Got a lot of crap. I gotta remember to actually. Yeah, I'm, that's all I'm gonna do for now. There. Let me save. 
I remember to take all the uh, junk out of her inventory and just put it in the workbench there. Um, let me see where I'm at, though. Oh, we were at the quarry. This probably takes us right back out to the quarry somewhere, or by the quarry. See what. Hello, Edward, and welcome to the stream. Edward Ryan, hey, what's up? And Tanya H, what's up? Where are we? Wow, we're a long ways from where we were. Where is the freaking quarry? Quarry's way over there somewhere. Where the hell are we? Dang, look how far away we are. We're at University Point Pharmacy. Gotta remember that. University Point Pharmacy. Oh, man, we're a long ways away. How do we get back? That's University Point in there. I don't want to go in there. Vault 88. Um, yep, sorry about the boobies and stuff, peoples. <laughs> we solved a body. Oh, wait. Oops, LOL. We saw the body. Why you turn it back on? <laughs> I knew that was fake wall. Yeah, I knew it was when I first saw it. I figured you could probably get out. There's different entrances, it looks like. So that's pretty cool, in and out of this place. I want to find out where that metro goes also. Um... Do you know what mods are on? What nudes? It's um, Caliente's beautiful body enhancements, I think. CBBE is what they call it on Nexus. It's a Nexus mod, though. They don't have that one on Bethesda.com. Are you going to fix that t tomorrow? I'm going to fix it tonight. Turn it off now, please. This is the second time you accidentally did that. I can't turn it off while I'm in the middle of the stream. I have to actually go into the mod manager, out of the game, go to the mod manager, and play around with the mod manager with this thing called a body slider. And it, what it does is it makes the clothes fit. Actually, some of the clothes that they're wearing uh, will be a lot skimpier once I do that. But if you take their freaking clothes off, they at least have a freaking bikini under them. So, yeah. <laughs> he can't fix it. If he's trying, tries to, he will have to stop the stream. Yep. Edward knows. Yeah, he can't fix it till he, while he's in the game. I just got to remember to do it while I'm not in the game. I just forgot all about it. I've been busy doing other crap when I'm not playing, when I'm not doing this. So we'll have to wait until he is done. But it is almost time anyway. Be right back. No, not the nudes I know about CBE. I want to know what the other mods. Oh, look in the description below. There's links. There's a link to a list of all the mods that I have in here. There's about 70 something here. If you um, want to know all the. I also did a, another playthrough not too long ago with over a hundred mods and I got a 
it, you'd have to go back to my channel and look for the sexy modded Fallout 4 on my channel. There's a playlist of it. Sexy modded. And that has, in the description of that, it also has a another link that has the list of all those mods. So yeah, I have a lot of mods. <laughs> I got some Tupac Mo um, Tupac clothes retexturing one skimpy skimpy clothes or skimpy outfits or something and that's the one that I'm gonna that I don't have on right now that I need to put on and that's the one that has the bathing suits so I'm gonna have to go and do that I gotta remember as soon as I get off and it's probably about time I see what time it is. Oh, yeah. It's exactly time. It's 10.30. I'm going to go back to the main hall here, and then I'm going to save. And then I'm going to exit. And I'm going to have to try to remember. I'm not going to probably do it tomorrow. Um, which is the way back? Oh, this way. I need to do a little bit of this. I need to at least trash it out. I need to scrap everything while I'm not streaming. Make everything scrapped real good like it is in here. Get the whole whole place, all these freaking extensions and everything scrapped out. I need to do that off camera. And then I can actually do a little bit of the building on camera during the stream tomorrow night. No, she don't need this chair anymore. Yeah, I'll leave it. What are you doing? I wish she would get up so I could see what's on her computer. I want to see what kind of freaking experiments that she is doing. If I could, I can assign her. I could unassigned, unassigned. I can ex assign her to something else. I could put something else in here, like some plants, and make her go freaking tend the plants for a while, <laughs> and then check out her computer. I don't know. Okay, so that's that's all for tonight, guys. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Sorry about the booby slips. The nip slips, they, they will be taken care of by tomorrow because I'm going to do that as soon as I get off. If I don't, don't remember, Darcy will remind me. <laughs> um, and my cat ran off. Oh, no. <laughs> or you're back with your cat and then it ran off hey so what kind of mods do you have like gear stuff he said it's he has so many he can't remember them all they're in the description look down in the description they're all categorized they're all categorized in I got categories of of uh, environmental ones. I got ones of all, all the text retexturing, all the weapons mods. I don't have a whole lot of weapons mods this time. I only have three, and I have all those on me. I have this one. It is a custom-made sword that I made. I modded out, made it a lot stronger, but it's still got the revolutionary saber texture or whatever. But I want to retexture it when I get a chance. Um, but this is a really good one. It's called Darcy's Darcy's Holy Diver. It says it right there. Serrated Darcy's Holy Diver. That's Darcy Darcelin, the mod uh, moderator on the chat. Also, I have this one. It's a scar. It replaces the assault rifle. That big, fat, bulky, round, ugly assault rifle that they have in the game. It's with a sleeker assault rifle. I like it a lot better. And I also have this one, which I like it, but I need to, I need to replace this iron sight. I, 
or this this site. I want to put an iron, put it back to the iron site because I can't stand that at nighttime. It's really distracting. I wish it was more like this one. This one's got a really good sight on it. But yeah, that's the only weapons mods I have. Um, I've got a few armor mods. That's uh, she's wearing something that came out of um, the Raider overhaul mod that I have, and uh, she's wearing a bodysuit. I can't remember what it's called, but that's a mod. But yeah, look in the description. They're all categorized. All the female mods, all the all the body mods, all the clothes mods, all the armor mods are all in different categories. So it's easy to find them. But they're all down below in the description. And yep, that's all for the night, guys. Come back again. I'll be back tomorrow night at 6.30 Pacific Time with another episode of this. And the following night, following two nights i'll be back with witcher 3 so hope to see you guys there and oh and check my channel um i are i've been uploading oh god i forgot to do fallout 3 today uploading fallout 3 i'll do that after i get off tonight too um and i'm editing fallout new vegas uh in half hour segments so all for the night, guys. Adios.